here we're going to show you how to use our indoor dome cameras. So here, the dome, in order to open it, you simply just counterclockwise rotate it and try to separate the two and it just pops off. And here's a little tab too if you wanted to insert something that's plastic to separate from the bottom, but with enough pressure sideways, you can take these apart. And once you have it open, this is the camera carriage and you can orient your camera uh, sideways like about 90 degrees uh, rotation you have to get the picture right side up. And then of course, um, if you use a little bit more force, you can actually move the carriage around, but we have it tightened on purpose. It's tight on purpose here when it comes out of the factory so that the camera just doesn't start freely moving around. If you break the bottom um, tabs here, then of course the camera is no longer going to stay in position. So carefully rotate the camera. There's only a little bit of freedom here because there is a pigtail in the bottom of the camera threading out the, the base of the dome. And here in our 4-in-1 cameras, you have the ability to switch the camera signal. So it says which way, if you flick the joystick, what the signal will become. So facing this way, it says up. If you press it and hold it for like three seconds, the video on your monitor will switch to analog signal. CVBS is analog, CVI is HDCVI, TVI is HDTVI, and AHD is AHD. So in this case, we're going to put it back on CVI because that's the signal method we use. Hold it for three seconds until you see the video switch. If for some reason you get like an on-screen display menu, as we have here, and what you need to do is disconnect power from the camera and then reconnect power. That's the easiest way of exiting that menu. And then if you, you hold the CVI switch again, and watch the video become HD. So now the video has become HD. It takes a little while for the DVR to recognize the video depending on the type of DVR you're using. So now, here's what we're, we're going to do. To show you how to use the lens. So the lens in here is accessible by popping off the top be very careful and you will notice that there are lens adjustments on this camera these are tight from the factory when they're shipped out so the lens doesn't move around due to uh, temperature changes so if you want to toggle the lens you want to unscrew this first just a little bit don't completely take it out and use a hand screwdriver just like I am otherwise you're gonna end up breaking the lens then you can basically toggle the zoom on the lens. You need to unscrew a little bit more. Now it's freely moving. But once you tighten it, it won't move anymore. So don't fight with it. Just keep on unscrewing until you're able to move the lens. And here we go. Like I'm gonna set. tricky sometimes so patience comes a long way and here we go I've zoomed in into this metal grid we have in the back and once you're done setting it to the desired zoom length tighten it back by using your screwdriver or your fingers and just basically clockwise tightening it now it's really important you do this by hand please do not use a hand screwdriver otherwise you're going to break the lens and that's basically it once you're done put it back on top there's really no right way to put it, just put it back on top and then orient the camera you want, put the top back on, and mount the camera.